Hi everyone, this is Daryl Legacy, Instructional Designer at Hack. This video will show you how to make your course and materials available after the semester ends for students that received an incomplete grade. This will allow them to see the content and finish assignments or quizzes. Let's say the semester just ended and you have one or several students who earned an incomplete grade and need to have access to your course to finish work. If the semester's ended, that course will no longer show up in the default list of courses for them on their D2L homepage. In fact, they'll probably only see their upcoming courses. If fall semester just ended, D2L will roll over and show them spring as the default semester on the D2L homepage. However, if they click on previous semesters, they can see their old courses. Going back to summer 2020 shows us this course which is marked as closed. However, the course is still accessible to all students. Here, I'm signed in as a fake student account, and you can see that I can click into the course just like normal. I can then go to content and see all of the regular material. I can also go to discussions, and I can view any discussion threads that are not past an end date. I can also continue to post to any thread that isn't locked. If I go to Dropbox, I can also see and submit any assignment that isn't past an end date. And with quizzes, I can see past results and start any quiz that isn't past its end date. An important note here, students can continue to use and submit these assessments even past a due date, though it will still show as late. Only an end date or a locked date in discussion will stop a student from using these. This means that if you do have end dates or lock dates for any assessments that you want a student to be able to use, you'll need to give them special access. We'll include our video showing how to give special access at the end of this video, and we'll link to text instructions showing how to give special access in the description. After you've checked to make sure there are no end dates or given special access for assignments that do have them, you need to make sure the course is active. Go into the course and click Edit Course. Then click Course Offering Information. Scroll down until you see the semester and the dates of the course. The box that says Course is Active should be checked by default. If it isn't, make sure to check it and then click Save at the bottom. Remember that the end date doesn't really matter as it only determines whether or not the course has the closed banner over it. The end date on the course here doesn't actually stop a student from accessing the material, unlike an end date on a piece of content or an assessment inside the course. If you leave the course's active box unchecked, the course won't show up for the student anywhere in D2L under any semester, and they'll not be able to access it in any way, so that is the most important setting to check. You can remove the end date entirely if you want, but that may cause some confusion, so it may be better to just leave the original end date. In that case, though, you'll want to let your incomplete students know to click back to the previous semester on the D2L homepage and that the closed banner doesn't stop them from getting in. These steps should help you ensure your students are able to keep working to finish any unfinished work. If you have any questions, please contact me or someone else on the CDI team.